everyone. In this craft video, I'm going to show you how to make a hot air balloon out of paper and a cardboard roll. We have our little glass raptor friend riding in it. Um, and here are the materials you'll need to make it at home. So you're going to need five different um, colored sheets of paper. You can use cardstock or construction paper. That'll be the balloon itself. You're also going to need some yarn or twine to hold the basket onto it. And then for the basket itself, you'll need a uh, half a cardboard tube and um, you can use markers to decorate it or paint or um, construction paper, whatever you wanna use, stickers. Um, to put it together, you'll need some glue, tape, um, you'll need a hole punch or you can just poke a hole with a uh, pencil, which you also need, and you'll need scissors, and that's it. Okay, let's get started. So, to make your balloon, you're going to need to make a balloon template. Um, out of paper color that you're not going to use. Um, and it'll be like a light bulb shape, sort of like this. You can trace something circular and then add to the bottom, just like a rectangular sort of object. Um, and then once you cut that out, the template, you're going to replicate it five times with each color that you'll be using. So with this balloon, I'm using red, orange, uh, light blue and even lighter blue and I'm going to um, cut another side of the balloon out in green. First I'm going to trace the template I need. this half of our balloon um, and now we're going to fold it in half um, and you want to do the same thing for each um, part of the balloon that you cut out so with these I folded them all in half like that so that's what I'm going to do with this one Make sure to line it up really well. Now that it's folded, I'm going to glue it on.
just gonna glue it onto this um, part of the balloon. And, and to complete it, I have to glue it on to this fifth of it. And then, <laughs> and then you'll have your full balloon. Now the balloon part is done, um, but I have to attach it to the basket. So to do that, um, you'll need to punch holes in four different sides of the balloon. Doesn't matter which sides to do it. holes punched in here and now um, you'll need four pieces of string, yarn, twine, whatever you want to use and then what I did is just put the yarn through here and then tied a knot at the bottom to secure it on. Just keep doing that. Each hole you need. So my strings are attached, but they're a little long, so I'm going to trim them with my scissors. Okay. Now you can either tape the strings to the inside or glue them inside, however you want to do it. It's a little bit tricky, but I'm going to use tape, so I'm really small pieces. Okay. 
baby. Now we have our balloon. <laughs> There's a little bit of extra string hanging out, but you can also, what I did with this balloon is I um, traced a circle on some cardstock and then cut it out. So you can have some dinosaurs or Legos <laughs> riding inside of your basket. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have fun making your paper balloons at home and I'll see you next time. Bye.